equal parts. Select all the pictures that show equal parts. So I'm going to open up my scratch pad to help. If I look here, I see one, two, three parts. But are they equal? This part right here, our third part, labeled three, seems much larger, there's a lot more to it, than parts one and two. So these ones are not equal. Now let's look at this one. I see one part, two parts, three parts, and four parts. Well, are these all equal? Well, I see they're all triangles, and they all look very close to the same size. So I think these are all equal parts. Now let's look at this one. We have one, two, three, four, five equal parts. Five parts, and now we have to determine if they're all equal. Well, this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one, they all look equal. So this one actually has two pictures that have equal parts. This shape and this shape both have equal parts. We're gonna select all the pictures that show equal parts. So I'm gonna look here, I see one part here and two parts here. Are they equal? Well, no, I think if they were equal, I'm gonna try my best to draw a straight line, it would look more like this, straight down the middle, the exact same amount on both sides. So this one is not equal. I'm looking here, there's one, two, three, and each part looks very equal. They all look like they're about the same size. So yes, this one has equal parts. If this shape were to have equal parts, it would look just like this one. There's one, two, it's split right down the middle, and they're both equal. So this one also has equal parts. So there are two shapes here that have equal parts. Now let's look here. I see one, two, three, four parts. And now let's look at the size of each part. Does the size of each part look equal? Yes, they all look to be about the same size. Here I see one, two parts. Well, are they equal? Is this part the same as this part? Yes, again, we have equal parts. This one we have one, two, three parts. Are these three parts equal? No, this part is much smaller than this large part right here. So this one is not equal. Select all the pictures that show equal parts. When I'm looking at this one, I see one, two, three, four. Do we think that these are all equal parts? No, I can see that one is much smaller than four or three, and two is kind of in the middle. So these are not equal parts. Let's look at this one. One, two, three, four. And all of these triangular pieces look like they're all equal parts. So yes, this one does have equal parts. Now let's look at this one. I see one, two, three equal parts, or three parts, and we're trying to decide if they're equal. And one, two, three, they all look equal to me. So nice job. Let's close our scratch pad, equal, equal, and move on. Now I'm looking here at this one. I see one, two, three, four. All four of these look like equal parts. Now I'm looking at this one. One, two, three. So I see one, two, three parts and all three of these look like they're equal. I'm looking at this one. One, two, three, four. And all four of those parts look equal equal as well. So in this case, all three of these shapes have equal parts. Nice job. Now let's look at this one. Select all the pictures that show equal parts. So let's see, there's one, 
to three parts. So if there's three parts, let's see if they're equal. Well, this part, this part, and this part, they all look equal. So yes, this shape does indeed have equal parts. I see one part, two parts. Are these equal? Well, I can tell that it's split right down the middle and both of the sides look to be exactly the same. So this is another one with equal parts. Now we have one, two, three, four parts for this shape. And I'm looking and all four of them appear to be the same size. So we have three shapes here, all with equal parts. Now select all the pictures that show equal parts on this one. So I'm looking here, I see one, two. Well, these parts definitely don't look equal. This part is much larger than this small part over here. So that is not equal. I see one, two, three parts here, and they appear to be equal. All of them seem to be about the same size here. So yes, this one is equal. I have one, two, three parts in this rectangle and looking at each part, each part looks to be about the same size. So all of these are equal as well. Nice work. Let's look here. Oh, this one has a different color to it, a bit of shading, which we haven't seen yet. There's one, two, three, four, five, six parts on this one. But if I look, this piece, piece one, seems much larger than piece three. You can tell by how much room I had to write the numbers in. So these do not look equal. Now I see one, two parts here, and these look equal. And I see one, two parts here, and both of these parts seem equal. So we have two shapes here that are equal. Select all the pictures that show equal parts. Well, let's count our parts. One, two, three, four, five. Well, it appears to me all of these seem to be the same size. They're all roughly the same size. This one has one, two, three, four, and all of these seem to be the same size. All these triangles seem to be the same. And now I see one, two, three, and all three of these seem to be the same size. So in this one, all of these are equal. Show the pictures that have equal parts. Well, this is a fun one because all of our shapes, our rectangle, our circle, and our triangle, all are cut in half. And all of them look to be going directly down the bottom or to be directly in half. So each part and all of these shapes is the same size. Nice job. Good job today.
friends.